Hey guys and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's Dragon Quest XI video guide, we're going to be showing you how to get the Artisan or Trodane, which is a costume for the Luminary. Now, you will have to be pretty late game to get this, maybe post game, uh, because we are going to need some pretty special materials to get this. Now, you only need two materials, technically three, but um, one of them is the normal Trodane set and you get this through the story anyway. So the other two materials you are going to need, by the way, the recipe you should also start with pretty much in the game. So you don't have to worry about the normal set or the recipe, you'll get these through the story, no problem quite early on in the game. So for the other two materials, we're going to need a pet pop, one for the hat and one for the actual clothes. So we need two pet pops. Uh, these are pretty hard to get. Now, you may have got some, I think I believe you can get two just by doing the game and opening chests and stuff, and I think a side quest, but chances are you probably already used them. Now, there is a way to constantly get pet pops. First of all, you are going to have to rebuild cobblestone in post-game. If you're not quite sure how to rebuild cobblestone, I'm going to leave a guide in the description that I made about rebuilding cobblestone. So once you do rebuild it, uh, there is going to be a new shop run by Dirk. He is going to sell pet bops for a pretty unfair price, let's just say 200,000 gold a piece, and we're going to need two of them, so that's a mere 400,000 gold. Now, I'm also going to leave in the description a really, really good method of farming gold. You could probably get these 400,000 pieces of gold in a matter of 10 minutes uh, with this method. So make sure you go and check that out if you're not too sure how to farm gold fast enough. Uh, the other item we're going to need, uh, also two, one for each piece, is going to be a collider cloth. There's only one method you can get this item uh, in this game and that is by trading Serpent Souls with Crystalinda at Sniffleheim Castle. Now, Serpent Souls you can pretty much get from any dragon or demon kind of enemy. Uh, for instance, this one right here, if you go to the north of the Galapolis Desert, there's going to be these guys just here, there's two of them, these respawn really quick, just go in there with Eric and steal it, uh, like just here, you can do it really, really quickly, and there's two, so just get these two, go and take them back to Crystalinda and get the two Collider Cloths. And that's pretty much it guys, go to a camp and forge away, so hopefully it's helpful, if it is, please go like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time guys. Hey guys, if this guide was helpful, please consider supporting me on Coffee with the link in the description. This will allow me to do this full time. Really do appreciate it guys. Take care.